two golfing legends, Tiger Woods and Phil Mickelson, about to face off in a $9 million showdown. Unprecedented pay-per-view match. They sat down with ABC's Adrian Banker right here on GMA. And Adrian, how are you doing? This has been amazing. I have to tell you, to be in the presence of sports royalty, wow, so awesome to talk to these two. Tiger Woods, cool and confident. Phil Mickelson says he hates to lose. Both having fun with this contest, though fiercely determined in this high-stakes winner-take-all match. Better than most. Absolutely incredible. Two of the greatest golfers to ever play will compete in a first-of-its-kind one-on-one match. His smack talk is under the breath and his lips don't move so that you can't necessarily identify him as the as the assailant. This Friday, Phil Mickelson and Tiger Woods face off for a staggering $9 million. And for the first time, Tiger and Phil will wear live microphones. Viewers will hear everything. There's a bit of a risk there because mm -hmm. Anytime you let somebody in, uh, let them know your innermost thoughts and feelings. Is that going to get in your head, Tiger? Well, I have more mics around me every <laughs> single round That's I true. play in. Tiger still draws huge crowds. In September, Woods won the PGA Tour Championship, his first title in five years after four back surgeries. I've won events, but that that was a different level. It was different energy that was, you know, the, the people were, were putting out. The level of yelling in the dust bowls had were incredible. That really showcased uh, how much you've been missed. Both had a comeback this year. Mickelson won the World Golf Championships in Mexico. The two friendly rivals came into their Sin City duel with a spirited volley over Twitter. Woods posting, it's on. Mickelson's response, I bet you think this is the easiest nine million you will ever make. That You didn't have Twitter before this match was announced. You yeah. had no Twitter account. I had no Twitter. And all of a sudden, you were on Twitter talking smack about Tiger Woods like you want a piece of this. It's not meant to be in your face. It's meant to be kind of self-deprecating and funny, but... <laughs> Does it feel that way, Tiger? It's just a big butt. Uh, <laughs> doesn't always come across that way, yeah. though. As competitive as they are, they have a deep respect for each other. But I mean this sincerely. When when Tiger came along and, and brought the game into the stratosphere, and we st started on this meteoric rise, and we had increased ratings and increased purses and increased off-course opportunities, nobody benefited more than I did. What would you say are Phil's greatest strengths in the game? Well, in the game, one, his creativity. The short game that he's has played over the years is probably the best that's ever lived. I love how you forced him to say nice things about me. Well, <laughs> They share stories like Mickelson's first majors win at the 2004 Masters. In 2005, Tiger won. In 2006, Today, Phil earns the green jacket again. He put the jacket on me <laughs> and, and took yeah, the jacket on him. <laughs> so you guys were meant to yeah. be. This was uh, meant to it was, be. It was funny. Uh, and I'm, I'd send him photos of him putting the jacket on me in the very next year. For the I autographed a photo of awesome. you are putting the jacket on me in 2006, and I, I write, Tiger, it fits great, Phil. <laughs> <laughs> Our best today is still better than, I believe, the younger players. I believe we can still win multiple times. I think that we have multiple wins in, in us as well as more major championships. It's getting harder now as we get a little bit older. But yes, I believe we can do it. Ahead of Friday, Mickelson's betting he'll birdie on the first hole. Wood says, not so fast. So <clears throat> there's a... Uh, there's a million ways to putt, a million different ways to stroke. Uh, I don't really think too much about the stroke. I just kind of look at the target. First of all, he just admitted he doesn't really think much. <laughs> I try not to get in my own way. And then stroke it. Yep. Done. You see? <laughs> <laughs> he made that look pretty easy. No, to I... Next. <laughs> in true fashion there, right? <laughs> drop the mic and drop the club. They believe events like this could change the face of the game, really bringing us all up close and personal. They have drones and fans will be able to make live wagers. <laughs> and and I, I can't wait to hear the microphone, yeah, that's the microphone awesome. conversation. Oh my goodness. It, but they also make some charitable side bets yes. on top of it. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Uh, a lot of money at stake here. You know, the nine million goes to the winner, but then they will bet at each hole or at six, certain holes. You know what? It's interesting. Phil has already challenged Tiger, saying he will definitely make a birdie on hole one 
and he will, you know, put two hundred thousand dollars at stake. So yeah, right two hundred thousand. Because the nine million wasn't enough. Yeah, yeah. Wait, so know, Tiger took that bet. Tiger, Tiger took the he bet. In fact, it. he doubled it. Yeah. It was one hundred thousand, and Tiger's yeah. like, double it. Yeah. Yeah. But well, well, you have to take the bet to be yeah. honest with you. Yeah. <laughs> one, one interesting thing. I don't know if you guys knew this, but it was funny when I was asking, you know, Tiger about coming back after the back surgeries mm -hmm. and the nerve pain and so many injuries. He said, you know, I'm reinventing my swing based on the surgeries yeah. at 42 years old. He said this is the same age my dad was when he picked up the game of golf. Wow. Oh, yeah. okay. George and I have been reinventing our swing. That hasn't quite worked, <laughs> <laughs> hasn't quite worked out as well. <laughs> you said it was an honor to be in sports royalty. George and I are in sports royalty. Uh, every, every day. Yes. Every day. Good it's your point. birthday. I you gotta got to be nice. <laughs> yeah, thank you. I knew the kindness was for a certain reason. <laughs> Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.